The world makes you think that if you have the wisdom of God, you're stupid, or you're narrow, or you're bigoted, or you're backwards, or you're uneducated, or you're going to be miserable. But I want you to see that if you embrace the wisdom of God, you are of all people to be envied. You will be blessed, the value, the worth of wisdom. Verse 10, take my instruction, says Lady Wisdom, instead of silver. You've got a choice between wisdom and a raise, take wisdom. Skip the raise. That's what it says. Choose knowledge rather than choice gold. Would you rather win the lottery or have God's wisdom? Think about it. If you get God's wisdom, you will have done better than winning the lottery. For wisdom is better than jewels. This is what verse 11 says. And all that you may desire, everything you could possibly want, if you could have it with, you know, just with, you know, wave that wand, that magic wand and get anything your heart craves, all that you may desire cannot compare with wisdom. Verse 18, riches and honor are with me, says Lady Wisdom, enduring wealth and righteousness. My fruit is better than gold, even fine gold, and my yield than choice silver. I walk in the way of righteousness and the paths of justice, granting an inheritance to those who love me and filling their treasuries. Boy, you read this, why would we not want wisdom? 